चैप्टर ट्वेंटी फैगन आस्क चार्ली बेट्स टू फॉलो नैन्सी वेयर एवर शी गोज इट वॉज संडे नाइट द बैल ऑफ द नियर बाय चर्च वॉज स्ट्रिकिंग द आर साइक्स एंड फैगन वेयर टू गैदर इन द हाउस ब्रेकरस रूम दे पोज इन देयर टॉक टू लिसन इलेवन ओ क्लॉक नैन्सी पुट ऑन हर हैट एंड वॉज लिविंग द रूम वेयर डू यू थिंक यू आर गोइंग साइक्स आस्क हर Not far, I said. Where? Where do you think you are going? I don't know where. Then I do. Now here, sit down. I don't feel well, the girl said. I need some fresh air. Put your head out of the window, then. I want it in the street. Then you won't have it. Sykes went to the door and locked it. He pulled her hat off her head and threw it on the top of the cupboard. Now, stop quietly where you are, will you? The girl looked at him wildly. Let me go. Let me go, Bill. Just for an hour, she began to sob pitifully. Then she threw herself on the floor in front of the door. The girl's gone mad, Sykes said. Get up now or he raised his fist to strike her. Let me go, screamed Nancy. Sykes seized her arms and dragged her struggling into the next room. He looked to the door. Nancy went on screaming like a mad woman. Sykes went back to Fagin. What a strange girl she is, he said, whipping the sweat from his face. You may well say that, Fagin said very thoughtfully. What did she want to go out for? Sykes asked. I don't know. Fagin told him, still very thoughtful. I have never known her like that before. Soon after this, Fagin went home. He was still very thoughtful. Was Nancy tired of Sykes who treated her so badly? Had she found a new friend? If she has, it may mean danger. Fagin thought, who knows what she may tell him about us. Well, he must find out. That was easy. He would get one of the boys to follow Nancy wherever she went. Yes, that was what he would do. The next morning, he said to Charlie Bates, Charlie is my dear, I have a job for you. A job where you will have to be very careful. How much do I get for it? A whole pound, my dear. Charlie eyes shone. What do I have to do? He asked something easy. Fagin told him, rubbing his hands together, follow Nancy whenever she goes out. Find out who she talked to. If you can listen to what she says, you don't trust her. It's not that, my dear. It's just that she has found some new friends. I must, I must know who they are. All right, I will do it. How several days? Charlie Bates watched Nancy. She seldom went out. When she did, he followed her like a shadow. But Nancy spoke to nobody. When Sunday came, Fagin said to Charlie, Sykes is out on a job tonight. He won't be back before morning. Keep a close eye and Nancy tonight.